in terms of the Emirates itself, I chose Exeter because of um, how well the course was going to prepare me for the PhD I was planning on doing, uh, as well as the uh, world-class staff, particularly in behavioural economics we have here at Exeter. I'm doing uh, behavioural economics and that involves a lot of uh, lab experiments. We have the Feely lab here and that's been amazing for uh, trying to pursue my research interests. Doing a MRS degree, um, to, to my experience, because it equipped me with uh, skills, techniques that would be needed and necessarily needed in further study and research. I would say it would create a really good environment for us to communicate with our lecturers and then we can just talk, inspire each other. So I, I really like the vibe there. The support I've received has been excellent um, and that's mainly come from my supervisors really. You're working alongside some of the best academics in the UK um, asking questions that I think are really, I think they're really interesting, obviously I do, that's why I study them. Research goes from kind of research ideas that we kind of have in our offices behind some computers <laughs> through kind of experiments and into seeing, into seeing the kind of policy implications of that. That's been really enjoyable. I've really enjoyed my time here. I think the, the economics department and business school more generally um, hosts a whole load of excellent academics. So your research will be really kind of stellar as well. So our program follows a structure of top programs in the UK and in the US. In the first year, students take microeconomic theory, macroeconomic theory, econometric theory, and in addition to that, they take research methods. In the first bit of research methods, they learn about mathematical tools. And in the second bit of research methods, they learn about programming. An important component of the module I teach is to get you comfortable with uh, computing languages such as MATLAB, R, Python. So you will be solving uh, practical problems in these languages so you can then take it to the next level yourself. My teaching covers topics in modern macroeconomics with an emphasis on, how, on the tools um, necessary to pursue research in macroeconomics. The emphasis is then on learning um, a new theoretical concepts and analytical techniques by using them to um, uh, discuss uh, modern macroeconomic topics. These are really exciting times to be at uh, Exeter. I am a member of the recruiting committee and we have been recruiting uh, excellent uh, junior um, colleagues uh, in, uh, in the international market, both from the US and from, uh, from the UK and the rest of Europe. These uh, colleagues have been trained by world-renowned experts in their fields and they are developing research projects and also field experiments, both in developed countries and also in developing countries. Our academic staff is well respected in the international academic scene. They do not only publish in top international journals, but on top of that, they are editors or editorial board members in journals such as Economics and Human Biology, the Oxford Bulletin of Economics and Statistics, the Review of Economics of the Hustle, or CC for Economic Studies, just to give a few examples. Um, so Exeter is a really nice city. Um, it's got a really nice kind of vibe about it, very kind of friendly and open. I mean, everyone in the southwest is pretty friendly, actually, but Exeter is particularly friendly um, and welcoming, so that's really nice. And, yeah, th th there's definitely enough going on for me. There's, um, th there's lots of gigs, um, like, there's loads of really nice pubs as well. So it's not, like, it's not a really small city, but it's not, like, overwhelming. So the size leads itself really well to, uh, well, particularly student life. So <laughs> having been here for so long, I've experienced uh, all facets of that. Uh, and then also particularly the, so the societies and sports that Exeter offers, it honestly leads itself really well into a good student life. Upon graduation, we expect our grad students to make an impact. This sort of impact could take many different forms. They could join academia, they can join the government or they could like uh, work on a private in the private sector. So why you should come to Exeter to your MRS and PhD? Well, Exeter will provide you with a very supportive environment from very caring academic staff. You will find great opportunities to collaborate with them, but also you will find internal and external seminars and also funding and research and teaching opportunities. At the end of the day, Exeter is located in probably the loveliest place in the country.